Chapter 85. At this feast, the spirit of Yahuwah fell upon me, and laying aside my garments, I danced before Yahuwah, and sang unto Yahuwah a new song, saying, Blessed art thou, O Yahuwah, who has given unto man knowledge of thy ways, that he might understand thy truths and see thine abundant mercies. Blessed art thou, O Elohim, who art full of compassion and grace, for the greatness of thy power, the abundance of thy truth, the profusion of thy mercies over all thy works. Rejoice the soul of thy servant in thy truth, and through thy righteousness make me clean before thee. Blessed art thou, for thou hast placed in the mouth of thy servant the sacred words of power, that I might stand as thy minister continually, that I might confer thy grace upon thy children, and that I myself may return to thy presence. <clears throat> Chapter 86 Sarah also rose up full of the Holy Ghost, and danced and sang before Yahuwah, and this is the song of Sarah. In thee, O Yahuwah, will my soul be raised up, for thou hast bestowed upon me thy grace, whereby I am restored to thy presence. For I have entered into thine holy house and received the sacred rites of thy presence. Surely in my tent at night I will sing songs of joy unto Yahuwah, as I am overshadowed by the priesthood and lifted up in the foreshadowing of eternity. Surely in receiving the, thy spirit through the overshadowing of the priesthood, I have received salvation. Wherefore, in the midst of thy people, those who reverence thine holy name, I will praise thee and glorify thy name forever. Chapter 87 My wife Kadar also arose and proceeded to dance and sing before Yahuwah. And her song was, Blessed Yahuwah, or bless Yahuwah, O my soul, exalt his name among the people. I will praise thee, O Yahuwah, upon my bed when the wellsprings of my joy are opened up. I will praise thee at all times and seasons when the sun riseth upon the earth. I will praise thine holy name. When it is ordered, oh, I'm sorry, when in its ordered course the day reacheth its turning point at the meridian, I shall not fail to praise thee. Again in the evening when the daylight departeth, I will marvel at thy wonders and glorify thy name. <clears throat> Chapter 88. 88. Then rose up my wife Judith, who danced and sang, saying, Praise Yahuwah, who hath shown me the wonders of his ways. For as I lay upon my bed, enwrapped in the ecstasies of the Holy Spirit, when the Spirit rushed into me, I saw the vision of the Almighty, and heard that which is unlawful to be spoken. Yea, O Yahuwah, thou hast visited me, and I have heard thy wondrous secret, and I know that it is true. Through thine Holy Spirit, through the rites of thine holy priesthood, through the glorious inner vision to which thou didst open my mind in the moment of passion, thou hast caused a spirit of knowledge of, to well up within me, a fountain of strength and power, of loving kindness and glory in my Elohim. Thou hast put an end to the darkness of the world in me, and the splendor of thy glory hath become in me an eternal light. Wherefore, I will praise thy name forever and give myself unto thee. Man, this is just amazing. Chapter 89. When Judith had finished her song, all the congregation, being filled with the Holy Spirit, arose to their feet and began to dance and sing and praise Yahuwah and to prophesy in his name. Some saw holy angels in our midst, and others saw the heavens opened up and beheld Elohim seated upon his throne. And all were filled with his spirit and shouted praises to Yahuwah in joy joyness, joyousness until dawn. Then we all rose to Yahuwah and praised his for this great outpouring and worshipped him all that day. And we rejoiced in the grace of Yahuwah Elohim. 